hello, 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 hello. What is up, man? What up? Holy shit, five gifted from I? Thank you. Oh shit! Wait, I forgot to put in the title. New sub badges. Man, I love that lick. Five dollars from AJ, who says something wise. How's it going? Good, man. How are you doing, AJ? Thank you, 21 months, Isaac G. Chat, chat, chat. Do you guys see? Do you guys notice? Take a look, take a look, take a look. We got new damn emote. We got new damn, not emote. We got new sub badges. Ooh, take a look. I guess member badges is what I should call them, but whatever. We got new member badges, man. I think they look pretty good. Not to toot my own horn. I mean, I guess I'm not tooting my horn. I didn't draw shit. It was Elena. But they look good. If you guys aren't aware, hello, hello. If you guys are a member, you get a badge, right? And this is what it looks like right now. I'll show you the progression. So if you become a member right now, you get little Mogi, little blue Mogi. All right. After the first month, you get flower Mogi. You upgrade Mogis. After two months, you get Vespa. Which I'm thinking about changing, we're working on that, because I don't love the Vespa. Uh, not because I don't like how it's drawn, I just, you know, it doesn't make so much sense with the stream. After six months, you get Suica Watermelon. After one year, you get Jigglypuff. Two years, you get K-Truck. Three years, you get Coots. And four years, you get Golden Coots. Woo! Dumb Watermelon Madge. Okay. <laughs> Don't gotta take it out on the watermelon, dude. A little fucked up there. Anyway, how's it going? Damn, chat's moving. How we doing? How we doing? 25 months from C Note, Evan Hansen, Kylie, or William McDonald, girl with a laptop. Bubba Shane. When is book club dubbing? Ooh. It's a great question. And I have a great answer. But first, I have to thank you for 10 Canadian dollars, Remington, who said re Dylan, thank you very much. A right, a right tree, a right tree, a retreat. He forgot. I didn't forget. Okay, here's the thing. Here's the thing. It turns out Hitchhiker's, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy is long. And it's broken up into five books. I finished the book. The first book. I haven't started the restaurant at the end of the universe. I'm coming clean. It's not chapter one. It's literally hundreds of pages. The book just happens to be like 800 pages. And I realize I'm kind of a slow reader. I know that I'm an English major and what have you, but I read about one page every 90 seconds, which is not great pace. But for whatever reason, when I'm reading a book, like when I'm literally going line by line, I go through the line and then I like read another line and it's going good. And then I go to the third line, but it's actually the second line that I've reread a second time. And then I'm, and then I'm like, oh fuck. And then I go to the third line. And then when I'm at the third line, I'm like, what does that mean? And I feel like I don't understand a word. And then I look up the word. I don't know, dude, reading's hard. I just actually find it very difficult to read. Can I stroke your hair? It looks yum. Okay, pause. Horny jail. All right. You gotta back off on the hair, buddy. Brogan, thank you the five gifted. I appreciate that. Clay Dog, you made me addicted too. What? <laughs> that's, that's not a full sentence. Thank you very much, Kaylee B. Thank you, Chris. Captain Lester. Bird with diabetes. Sailor D. No flights to Yemen. Joining the Parasocial Club. Bubba Shane. I thought it was the first book. Listen and read at the same time. Well, if it's the first book, then we're set. Hanaki, thank you very much for joining the Parasocial Club. Troy Pizzaro and five gets it from Chris Suloff. So anyway, look, I, here's the thing. I got to do a... I'm, I was hoping to do it tonight. Fuck, man. Fuck, dude. Where does the time go, bro? I actually didn't waste my time today. You guys aren't going to believe me. I didn't waste all day today playing Balotro like I've done on other days of this week. I actually just worked today. We did a we did a yard podcast today at 9.30 a.m. 9.30 a.m. All right. I got a workout in today. 
I will come clean. I worked out today. Oh, I got bad news. Oh my god, I got bad news. Fuck, I forgot to tell you guys about this. <gasps> it's not even bad news. You guys aren't even going to care. You guys aren't even going to care. It's bad news for me more than it is bad news for you. But I do have news. This is not really the right, like, song. Sad Nintendo song. I'm no longer running the marathon in Los Angeles, March 17th. I've officially quit it. It was my Super Bowl once upon a time. And I know many people might call me a quitter. And to them, I would say, you're right. I did quit. Because the facts are I could get up and go run it. But yesterday, I filmed some stuff for Unpaid Intern. And then I, I, um, I went on a run. It wasn't a long run. It was three and a half, four miles. My first mile, I did an 840 split. My second mile was an 18-minute split. My shins were on fire. And I've realized that the only way for me to run a marathon is if I quit playing basketball on the weekends. Because basketball hurts my body. Especially because last week I got new basketball shoes and they are not very flexible. They're rigid. They get me quite sore. So I realized I basically have a choice. Either I quit basketball and I run full time or I keep playing basketball and I delay the marathon. And I came to the conclusion basketball is one of the best parts of my week. I'm not fucking phenomenal at it by any means. But the act of playing with a group of friends is more important to me than running a marathon on an arbitrary timeline. So although it's my Super Bowl, I have quit my Super Bowl. I'm delaying the marathon. There's my update. I think maybe when I break my shoes in, it might be a little better. <sighs> Probably not, though, because it's been bad for a while. Somehow you are always streaming in or have uploaded a video when I go to make my mighty my nightly noodles. Pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Arizelli. Arizelli. Open a public Minecraft server. Have us all join. Now we're cooking. We have a Minecraft server coming to the yard, I think. Tofurin, thank you very much. Statements are made. Thank you. Wagyu. Uh, five dollars. Oh, you finished your message, Clay Dog. I mean, I meant you got me addicted to Baltro. Clay Dog, can I come fully clean? Holy shit. When you wrote this message you got me addicted to, I was 95% sure you were talking about Balotro. 95. I did not answer because I secretly thought you might donate another five dollars to tell me what it was. And I scammed you out of ten dollars. I kind of feel bad about it now. Like, I didn't want to assume the end of the sentence. I could have filled in the blanks, though. <laughs> I didn't even intentionally do it. It's my sick, dark, twisted capitalist mind. <sighs> it's not extortion. That's not what that word means. Thank you very much, Koi. Thank you, Boofin. Sorry your shins ain't what they used to be. Sad but relieved face. Old man emoji. Boofin, eat shit. <laughs> Thank you, Ray, for uh, the seven months in the Parasocial Club. Dova, thank you. Trunge. Stream like you hit 23s in a row. I do that regularly. Can we get another Ludlock soon? Look, I want to play some Pokemon. Uh, you know what, man? We got a lot of shit to do, though. Here's the thing. I got a lot of shit outside uh, of stream and stuff that I'm working on right now. It's not even outside of stream and stuff. That's actually wrong to say. It's shit like Unpaid Intern. Unpaid intern, we got fucking... I'm cooking on a few other live stream event ideas. We got a lot going on. Tell me how to become a mod. You just can't. You just can't. What you have to do is you somehow have to hack the account of one of my mods. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't actually do that. Sorry, I shouldn't have said that. That was stupid to say. Don't do that. Don't, sorry, mods. Sorry, mods. Sorry, mods. Thank you, the 10 gifted Chris Suloff. Eric M, thank you, the one year... Patadon. Pat, 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 Thank you, the 11 months. 
the Yankees. Thank you for the 26 months. Nervous clenching. Joining the Parasocial Club. 65 plus shins, and it has eight upvotes. Can we downvote? What? Did they fucking remove downvotes here too? Ten dollars. Hey, Lord, I keep wasting money gifting to streamers, hoping they read my message. Hopefully, you read this, dude. Just stop donating to streamers. Look, man, I and every other streamer appreciate when you donate, but factually, streams are free content, and streamers at the top make oftentimes more money from just ad revenue, and they run ads. I'm sure you have seen. So never feel bad about not being able to sub or donate or whatever the fuck. It is not your responsibility in the slightest. And if you have some extra bread and you really want to give it to someone, I mean, shoot for a smaller streamer. I don't mind. They probably need it more than my ass. Just being real. I kept my shit low, too, because I don't like when I receive a lot of money from people. It is straight up one dollar to become a member. You should play basketball with Charlie. Uh, have I played with him before? I haven't. I would like to. Emmy Wemmy. Thank you, the 499. Can we get a basketball stream? Uh, I'd have to think about what it is. You know what would be kind of fun is streaming until I hit, like, I don't know, 10 threes in a row. What's a good number? 50 free throws in a row? What's the record for the most free throws made? Record most f consecutive... Most consecutive free throws NBA. Oh, that's higher than I can get. The answer was 97. Wow. 97 free throws. What the fuck, dude? Slime just sent me to this. To be a white guy is a constant struggle where you think a lot of things about Japan are interesting, but you don't want to be all weird about it. <laughs> I'm not weird. I don't... I don't even think that many things about Japan are interesting. You know? How's that, how's that for you? That's a little controversy. How about you stick that in your pipe and smoke it? My chat froze. This is not working. This is frozen. Now it's back. Thank you the two months. Lee, Distant Dawn, Wakeside. Tim, I'm stealing your job. Can I get your 2FA up now? Okay, Jesus Christ. Skylab, thank you. Communist Goose, Fly, T, Aiden, Kelly. Thoughts on hooping with viewers? I'm not parasocial, I swear. I wouldn't hope with viewers. <laughs> Recently got broken up with a relationship of four years, and I'm fucking devastated. Any experience or advice? Uh, what is it? Fucking delete. What is the modern version of delete Facebook, lawyer up, hit the gym? Do we have a modern version? It might just be take a zin, start a podcast, and hit the gym. <laughs> That's how you get over it, baby. Come on. Look, the advice for getting out of a relationship or being broken up with is the same advice it has been for hundreds of years, which is I don't have advice for you because father time is going to take care of that problem. And that's not something that you can really hear and absorb. It's just something you will naturally feel the effect of the more time that passes. But in the meantime, while father time's doing his thing, it's usually best to do whatever you can do to make your life better. For maybe not even present you, but for future you. Because right now you feel like shit, but if you turn that and fuel that into like simple things, which is maybe, you know, trying to get better education to get a better job or go to the gym more or learn a new hobby, then future you, when you're feeling a little bit better about life, will be so much more well-equipped to enjoy life. So that's my advice to you, is make future you proud so present you has to get to work. And and that might also serve as a bit of a distraction while you're going through it. No! Alright, boys, today I want to take a look at the subreddit because we haven't taken a look in a little bit. And then on sweet, 
Squeaks owes us a tattoo. So I want to take a look at some tattoo designs. I want to think about what it'll be, and I want to vote on it and lock it in. Does that make sense? Let me tag the entirety of my Discord. Let them know I'm live on YouTube.com slash at Ludwig slash live. Boom. 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 Hello. Help. There's trouble. I have fallen, and I can't get hard. I don't know what the fuck that was. Uh, recently broke up with my boyfriend of four years because he kept demanding to smell my feet. <laughs> and he had advice. Come on, man. Come on. How often do you think about Japanese culture? I don't think I think about Japanese culture that often. Look, man, I'll be real. I think as I've gotten older, the things that I like about Japan aren't like the superficial things that you might think of when you think about Japan. Like 7-Eleven or the trains are good. I certainly like a walkable city. But a lot of what I liked about Japan was how I felt as a human. And I felt very much uh, out of the spotlight. Very much... Just a random ass human in a sea full of human. And and I don't feel that often in my day to day, you know, because I am fucking Ludwig with a channel called Ludwig and I upload videos to Ludwig about Ludwig now and it's Ludwig time all the time. And it's a nice shift of gears. So that's kind of what I liked about it when I was there. I don't hate you guys. I like my job. But, you know, grass is always greener type beat, I think. Get the yard logo for a tattoo. All right, hold up on tattoo ideas. Hold up on tattoo ideas for a second. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Because we got to take a look at our subreddit. First off, first off, first off, I got this clip sent to me by a bunch of people. It's posted on the subreddit. Let's take a look at it. Ludwig, I've talked about him a bunch on this uh, That's this me. pod because I think That's he me. has one I... of the best, some of the most knowledge of online streaming because of how big Didn't he was on Twitch. Didn't have to add that copy yet. On... Could have just said had the most knowledge. A bunch on this, uh, this pod because I think he has one of the best some of the most knowledge of online just stop right there some i have some of the most knowledge fact next streaming because of how big he was on yeah, twitch blah, 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 and blah, blah. how big he was on youtube uh -huh. streaming mm -hmm. but he also uh put out a like hour-long interview with neil neil mohan right it's mohan true. um which was really That's good me. really funny also neil was great in neil. it and while he gave pr answers they were like fun PR answers and felt a little good. better. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. And then he also did a Thanks, quick video Marquez. on Colin or Colin Samir did a video looking at his, how he works with his channel, where he works and how he's kind of doing his, like him as a YouTuber and the people working under him. And then also this other company he's doing, which is more of I'm getting gassed up right now. I can't handle all this. How much you pay him, bro. A guy who does YouTube full time on a nerdy podcast I mean, that's my fucking, that's my main demo right there. Okay? You kidding me? When I'm sitting here saying how to be a streamer, how much do I make, how I'm operating my business, none of you fuckers give a shit. You're like, Ludwig, shut up. Can you watch 1,000 YouTube shorts for a stream? Thank you. <laughs> These are the type of nerds who like that content. He's building it and hoping it takes off. Ooh. After him, I haven't watched that one yet. It's good. I like it's really charts. good. I mean, Colin and Samir stuff's fantastic, and yeah. Ludwig is just super entertaining. That's fair. Yeah, I watched the Neil Mohan interview. He's the CEO of YouTube, by the way. He was the chief, chief of. Pro well, I don't like to call myself that, but I do think I do a lot of good things here. Product yeah. of YouTube now. He runs the whole thing. They addressed like every Thank time his name Brendan. comes up in our comment section, people are always Thank like, you the "That's the pond. NFT guy." Like he, he they, was the the CEO that wanted to do NFT stuff. They talk about that. They talked about briefly. That. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. NFT um, guy. But yeah, let. Ludwig is great. I would love for him to jump on the pod. I think you two could talk about YouTube and Twitch and just on social media in general for probably hours, and it would be yeah enthralling. So uh, if you hear this, where are you guys in New at? Jersey, don't know why. <laughs> Jersey, Ugh. Ugh. man, that's tough. That's tough. I'd be more inclined if you said Damascus. I'm going to keep it a stack. <laughs> I just, you know. Got to go to Jersey. Bro, that's where my ex is from, you know. You're making me go to the land of the beast. Jersey, man. 
They can't even pump their own damn gas there. And they have their own little inside jokes they're so fucking haughty about. Taylor Ham, pork roll. It's like, just tr eat bacon. Eat bacon, you weirdo. Why well, you would be, but come stop by <laughs> if you're ever if you're ever out here, uh, uh, for sure. All right, all right, man. All right, I'll consider. I'll consider. May, may, you know what make more sense on a pit stop on the way to New Hampshire? All right, a good state. People love the state of New Hampshire. It is true. Many people say this. Uh, all right, let's take a look at the subreddit, boys. See what we got going on in it. If you're not a part of the subreddit, you fucker should be. You fucker should be. Here you go. Here's the link. At least two of you are going to click it and subscribe. Thank you. It's been an active week for the subreddit, by the way. Uh, we had two of the like the biggest posts of the year. One of them got deleted. Not by me. I want to clarify. We had a post about the Dubai trip. It got deleted by the original poster. I think probably because I addressed it or they just didn't like seeing replies in their inbox. I don't fucking know. Uh, but we have another post. says, 10 years. Still waiting on an update. Uh, and there's a lot of red circles. R slash basketball Ludwig, how to dunk. I'm six foot tall and an athletic guy. My dream is to learn how to dunk. Does anyone have advice on what to work out and how to practice? Thanks for the advice, everyone. Right now, I can barely touch the rim. And yes, I can palm the basketball, but not well enough to hold it while jumping and swinging my arm. I play basketball daily, but I'll still work. At, I'll, I'll start working on the workout portion and I'll be back with my progress periodically. Whoa, Ludwig was not six foot in 2014, Lamal. Yes, I was. Bitch, where I was there. I was there. Let me let me check real quick. Was I six? Yes, I fucking was. I was there, man. I was I was uh I was how old was I? I was 19. I was 19 in 2014. Why not? That put him at 18. Everyone not everyone has a perfectly linear growth rate. I mean, he's literally said he's lying about his height everywhere because he, he is six foot as of right now. You don't think it's possible for an 18 year old who is six foot to say six foot. First off, I want to clarify two points. One, I'm not six foot right now. I have grown. I found out recently. I think I'm six one, maybe six two. I was six foot in college. This is a fact. Okay. It is a fact. I, and you know, let's not use the tired Ludwig short jokes. It is a fact, but I think I've grown an inch. Okay. I think I've grown an inch. I've, if, if anything, I've, I've made a deal with the devil. I've lost inches in other places. I've gained inches in my height. I'm feeling good about that fact. All right. Second thing, damn, this is 10 years ago. <sighs> that feels bad. 10 years ago. I posted this. Oh my God. That's so long ago. I can't dunk. I want to clarify. I'm not closer. I might be farther. Dude, honestly, because I'm not doing the marathon, I should probably just learn how to do three things. There's three things I want to learn this year, okay? I want to learn how to backflip, which I think I'm physically capable of doing right now. I just have to learn how to actually do the motion tuck and get over the fear. I would like to learn how to kickflip this year. I think I can get there with not too much additional time, maybe 10 hours of work. And then finally, I want to learn how to dunk. I don't know if it's even possible for me to dunk, but it'd be kind of beast if I could dunk. I just feel like I'm too fucking big, but I don't know. I got strong ass thighs. Maybe I got to do like quarter squats. Yeah, shake. I'm not doing the marathon. Shake. I'm out. I'm out. My legs are too fucked. And I'd have to quit basketball to run the marathon. And I don't want to quit basketball. It's one of the, my favorite parts of the week. Do a kickflip, then teach Maya. Uh, on Women's History Month, I would actually just sit my white ass down and let her teach me. You know what I mean? I don't know. I guess I'm different. Me, you, and Otto, man. Otto might be back. Streets are saying Otto might be back. But me and you, by the end of the year, we'll be there. We'll be there, baby. All right, what else we got on the subreddit? I found this neat photo of Ludwig. Dude, <laughs> no shit. I scrolled by because I, I, I take I take a look at my subreddit. I scrolled by. I thought this was a regular ass picture of me. And I was like, damn, what a what a shill post. You know, like, I, hey, I love Red Bull. I just can't believe that I have some random viewers shilling for Red Bull by posting a Red Bull picture. I didn't even realize. He's so big for you. 
He really is the epitome of esports athletes. <laughs> Red Bull is lucky they snatch him when they did. This makes me feel like if I lose 30 pounds, I'll be beautiful. Look, man. I'm not that big. It's obviously edited. Okay? I don't know how much I weigh right now. It's sub 200. We're close. I'll, I'll come clean. We're close. I'm like 195, but sub 200. Uh, Dubai, mogul male. What is little bro yapping about? We do not care. Play Elden Ring co-op with squeaks. <laughs> I think we have a, we have a perspective date. My perspective date is March 12th. March 12th. I think, uh, I think we'll do uh, around then that, that week at least. We're going to attempt Elden Ring in one set. Here's what we thought. Let's do Elden Ring. We're going to do it online. I think it's best for tech and for our streams. And I'm going to do it in one sitting, I think. And Squeaks will also be in one sitting. Not like literally sitting down, but like one stream. So like we did last time. But should we add something? Like, we're going to use the mod to make it co-op. I already beat the game in one sitting. Should we add difficulty? Or should we add, like, a timer? A randomizer? A randomizer is popular. If you are watching this and you are an Elden Ring nerd and or Elden Ring content creator, please DM me on Twitter or x.com and give me your sage wisdom. Because I want to do this Elden Ring co-op, but I want to make sure it's juicy. And I'm worried that as a video... If I put all this time and I'm beating this game with squeaks, everyone's just going to be like, dude, you already did that by yourself. You're just making it easier by doing it with squeaks. What's the difference? I'm, I don't know. But maybe I, that's also like a fake person that I'm inventing in my head. I don't know. The difficulty is adding squeaks because <laughs> he's so bad. I can bite that. What do you guys think of this? Ludwig dad, Ludwig mom, Ludwig Ogren. I, th I think it adds up. Okay, hope no liberals are mad at me for doing a bit of math here, but that shit adds up. I think you have too much free time. Does it actually work if you combine them? Does it make Ludwig Ogren? And if so, is it faster than using Japanese name? Who knows, man? Who knows? Mogul Mail deleted. I just saw last night Mogul Mail about stupid Hassan drama. I was going to watch it, fell asleep. Now I watch and it's gone. What happened? Why is it deleted? Just watch the re-upload and that'll answer your question. I've triple uploaded Mogul Mail this week. Every time I upload a Mogul Mail, though, I, I made a Mogul Mail today about Bellatro. If you guys don't know, Bellatro has been getting banned in certain countries and certain platforms. It got banned off Nintendo Switch. And uh, for, for stupid reasons. And anyway, I, I made a video about it because I really like Bellatro. I've been playing a lot of it. I, I think it's just a fucking um, excellent game. And a bunch of comments were like, and I got a bunch of DMs. They're like, when are you going to talk about the Wilbur drama? And I, this always happens when there's something going on. You know? But it's like, I feel like everybody knows about it. For one. But for two, I'm so... I don't know, man. I feel like I'm so fucking over. Not to say I'm above it. But it just doesn't interest me to, like, wait for juicy drama involving someone fucking up. And then the entire video being like, you see this toilet paper? They fucked up. Here's how they fucked up. I wouldn't have fucked up like that, but they fucked up. Here's whatever people think about them fucking up. Here's who got hurt in their fuck up. That's the fuck up. And then it's a whole ass video. I don't know, man. It just feels like, uh... It feels weird. It feels like I fucking... I don't feel like I should be this throne of authority who's casting judgment. Not to say that what Wilbur did was right, because it was clearly fucking wrong. He's a piece of shit boyfriend. But, you know, I also feel like I don't fucking need to be the person every time someone does something wrong, just sitting up here like, that was wrong. That was wrong. They should have done it. was wrong. So I try to pick... I don't know. I try to pick things that I... Or either like sillier, 
like Aiden Ross getting scammed, that I think are really funny. Or that has maybe some larger circumstance, you know, or if there's some bigger point that I want to make. But I don't know. Yeah, but our great, dullest, uh, lifeless, flavorless slop. But that's, sorry, Ludwig Plum gave me five dollars. But that's our great, lifeless, flavorless slop, and you're depriving us, and the tr trough is empty, and we are all so sad that the trough is empty, and we want our great, lifeless slop. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe you're right. I just feel like the pigs can eat better. But. Well, we'll see. Uh, unpaid intern has so much potential. Stands being underutilized. Little Alex Horn being used for tax. Uh, episode one was great, man. I don't think I've gotten more threads about a show than Unpaid Intern. I think the Taskmaster comparison is apt, but completely unfair. The contestants on that show are professional comedians or jobs to think outside of the box to make situations funny. It's very apparent that, like, Kaede's brain is 95% Valorant, and she did a good job in spite of that IMO. Uh, I mean, I don't give a shit. I'm unoffended. Taskmaster is, like, an, an insanely hilarious show. So even being in the same breath, that's cool with me. Don't... I'm not, I'm unfazed. My very legally distinct game show, Unpaid Interns, is flattered. Let Coot compete for her job back. Uh, I don't know about that one, man. Whoever bet on Ray being the reason for Baldur Gate's cancellation gets their massive payout. Hey, everybody. So it was scheduled on my calendar that I was going to leave for the movie cameo trip on the 29th, but I found out I leave tonight. I had streams and stuff planned for the next couple days, but I had to rush to get everything done. I have a camera for vlogging. Tina took pictures of me with her digital camera. I rushed for filming for a video with Zoe Coletti and her YouTube channel. Dude, what the fuck is Ray doing? Like, not in a mean way, but like, Valkyrie Ray is different, man. Like, other streamers, we just click the go live button. And we do some shit. But I feel like Valkyrie does like movie cameos and like music videos and like songs. She's always doing some shit. She's at like a fashion week. I feel like she's just kind of like a famous person. You know? I don't feel like I am like her. You know what I mean? You made the best event of the year. And don't get me wrong, bitch. I got this shit on my desk. I'm aware. But like. You've literally done most of those things. I've never been in a movie. I was in Bella Porch's music video for a second. Although I was really impactful. The way I opened the door was actually kind of like inspirational. And what else did I do? I guess I made a song. But not with, like, a famous person. You need a better manager? I don't think I'd want to do that type of stuff. It seems cool, but, like, ultimately, I hate when people ask me to leave my home. Because <laughs> I'm like, bro, I got to make videos and stuff. So every time I have to leave to do some shit, I'm always like, all right, fine. Had to cite Ludwig. What has it come to? Reference. Ogren L. I don't like how you referenced me. I don't know if this is like fucking Chicago or like MLP style or whatever the fuck MLA format. Don't just type Ogren L. Okay. That's the format. I don't give a fuck. Lie. Just say Ogren W. I won't be mad. I'm the dude. I feel like I should be allowed to be represented how I want to be represented. Not. I don't want to be represented with an L. 21 Feb, I confronted YouTube's scary new CEO. All right, what did you do? <clears throat> YouTube is the most used social media platform amongst Gen Z in the USA. With the CEO stating in a 2024 interview, we're sitting right now in the middle of what I think is the early phases of a profound paradigm shift in terms of what we're seeing with AI. This quote demonstrates how AI is planned to become even more prevalent in social media, despite AI algorithms already having shown to be 
blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I do some hard-hitting journalism. I am a cited man. It is not rare for me to be cited. How the hell did this happen? Ludwig Cryptosex. I gotta use my goose ass. Amazing new member badges. Shout out to Missy Elena for our new badges. Type one in chat to show off your cool new badge if you are a member. Uh, the reason for Dubai is... Uh, reason for Dubai is one ones located in open air season in Bahrain and all those under the you were doing you could devise a boat and then visa free and then I mean they got a thousand athletes I wouldn't pin it on one person uh, we looked at this unpaid intern appreciation posts I think last one and I think we're juiced I know I'm a bit late to the party. I generally lurk on the subreddit. Don't post much, but I had to do this front paid intern. This was for me the most, uh, most hilarious and entertaining Ludwig show. Uh, and Schlatt's Andrew Cuomo bit had me dying. All the other guests are very good. I hope Ludwig does more. I will do more. We filmed one yesterday, and it was, in Stanz's word, words funnier than the first uh, month, which is a, I was like, are you sure? Because the first month was very funny. And he was like, it's funnier. And I was like, whoa. So we're already, we're already filmed another one. Thank you for the $5, Aiden. Hey, Ludwig, eating a smoked brisket sandwich. That sounds electric. Demonic Wraith, thank you very much. Dude, I'm going to show you guys this real quick. This is not on my subreddit. This is on Big A subreddit, but I saw this. This dude tracked every ad that they saw throughout the day, starting from 5.57 a.m. to like 6 p.m. I'm just going to scroll through this. And I, I almost want to do this myself because I don't think we recognize how many ads we are served a day. Right now, I'm scrolling through a man's website where he tracked every single ad he was served. It is an overwhelming amount. Like, we are not talking about dozens here. There are a lot of ads that you see in a day. It's so invasive. That shit blows my mind. And I remember none of them. Look, man, I think we all like to think that we are above the ad cog machine. That we can recognize when we are being serviced something that is meant to get money out of our pockets. But the fact of the matter is we are not. Nobody's above it individually. Ads work. They just work. And everybody thinks they're above ads, but they fucking work, man. They just do work. So who are the people falling for it? And the thing is, you might not remember the ad specifically, but subliminally that shit does get in your head. Or maybe it gets into one of your friend's head and they recommend something. They're like, dude, you got to check out this show. Oh, man, you got to try out this fucking pillow I got. Dude, I tried this new fucking toothbrush. It's fire. Still, in a roundabout way, you're getting served by an ad. Just through somebody else. Anyway, ass dot cleaning. <laughs> uh, and check out this cool new croc. <laughs> Everyone's been linking me this. I feel like I had to open it up on stream just so you guys know that I saw it. I saw the crocs. I saw the crocs. I will say they are crazy. <laughs> they are crazy. These I think they're the most... Uh, insane Crocs I have seen from the recent collabs. Buy them? I do. You know what? 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 Hey, what's wrong with a twenty-first pair of Crocs? I'd say nothing. Can't go wrong with that. All right, Chet. It's time. I need your help. We have the pleasure of designing a tattoo that a one squeaks has to have on stream, uh, excuse me, has to put on his body for a temporary amount of time, okay? We get this privilege because I destroyed squeaks in a 1v1. So my question to you all, if you wouldn't mind throwing out some suggestions right now, is what we should tattoo on his body. It could be words, it could be design. It has to be within reason. I think Squeaks will buckle if we make it too crazy. It's 
It is a two-week tattoo. It's a henna tattoo. So, it's a, yeah, it's temporary. It will not be a permanent tattoo. I don't think he has a real tattoo. Make it a confederate flag. Okay. I don't love that. I don't love that. Right? I don't... Uh, look, man. I don't want to, like... You, I know you guys are immediately jumping to like, oh, what's the most depraved thing we could put on his body? The answer is a swastika. The the, the reply I would give you is we're not going to do that. <laughs> we're not going to do that. And I would think less with that line of thinking, right? This is very A to B. You're thinking very lame. Not to be hurtful, but you're thinking fucking lame. Dude, it's the most offensive possible thing. We'll just put that on his body. Call it a day. Right? Think of his body as like a wall in your hometown. What's the funniest thing you could put on a wall? I promise you the answer is not MAGA or a fucking swastika or whatever. This is not the funniest thing. It's the it's the easiest thing. Okay, but what's good don't come easy. Don't forget that. So I need better ideas. Yeah, like a penis. <laughs> now we're getting creative. We could put a big penis on his neck. Okay. A penis? What else do we got? How do I like fucking... I hate paint. What else? The yard logo. Okay, what else we got? Mario Goatsy, I think, is a little too... It won't look good as a tattoo. I'm pretty positive it won't look good. It's not... It's not... It needs to be simpler. I think similarly, my face also won't look good as a tattoo. Crocs. Okay, I don't love Crocs, guys. Yoshi and Obama sharing an intimate kiss. Hold up, let me get there. I just want to see if I have your vision correct. Obama kissing on cheek. So I just want to clarify, your idea is this, right? I don't love it, you know? It's definitely something. I don't know if I love it, per se. K 
Can it be Vaporeon, but like kind of sweaty and maybe a little exhausted in a good way? Luda, what the fuck does that mean? What? I'm trying to find a good image for you. Most of these I can't show on stream. I think all of these I can't show on stream. <laughs> okay. She's sweating, but I don't know. I don't think it's right. I just looked up Vaporeon sweaty. Okay, this could work. Chat, what do we think? She looks exhausted. I feel like that was part of the prompt. Absolutely fire. <laughs> All right, give me an idea. Think of the five gifted Anthony Patrick. Skur, yeah, plum, thank you. My school got caught on fire. Stonks. Dude, I'm sorry to hear that. That's... <laughs> what the hell? Discord logo and the word... Wait, and the word what? And the word kitten. Discord logo. Okay. Let's just try this out. Are we thinking like this? What about this? What about this? Check this out. Check this out. What do you think? What do you think? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Just just hear me out for a second. Just hear me out. And I I want you to like cuz I'm I'm scared so I'm going to show this and you guys are going to like be like, what do you mean? Like, no, there's no way we could do that. I want you to just think about it for a moment. Okay, I'm sensing a little bit of tension. Why is it racist? <laughs> what? Where's the racism? I'll actually explain to me why it is racist. This is a fun thing to do. <laughs> why do you think it's racist? Are you perhaps conflating people? <laughs> are we what are we doing here? I think he's an emotional terrorist. All right, okay. You know, I'm sensing a bit of tension. All right, round two, round two, round two, round two. How 
How about this? Imagine this across his neck. Uh, go on. What do you think about that one? What do you think about that one? That's not bad. We could also do, we could also, like, hold up, hold up, hold up. We could also do, we could also do ass dot cleaning. Which, if you don't know, actually brings you to my swipe bidets. And I could use him like a billboard. I think a QR code is worse. All right, here's the four, I think, ideas that have been the strongest. What do we tattoo? Ass cleaning. A penis. Discord kitten. I don't want to do the the sex the sexy Vaporeon that Luda really wanted. Guys, I don't want to do that. I don't know if I love that. Obama. What's his seven? Okay, here's not. That's not a bad one. All right, the final thing we can put on is the time for his seventy star PB that he got in Super Mario sixty four. As if he is so proud of it, he got it tattooed on his neck. Mods, can you make a poll? My Chrome has crashed. My Chrome actually crashed. Oh, Dude, I hate Google Chrome with such a fiery fucking passion, man. I hate it. I hate it. What tattoo? Uh, uh, oh, no, we got it. Thank you. All right, chat, vote, vote, vote. I'll wait for a few thousand people to vote. Uh, do the Bitcoin Dogecoin logo with self-made under it. Wait, that's kind of funny, though. Hold up, hold up. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll pick the winner because no one has majority and add that. A Dogecoin logo with self-made under it. That's kind of fire. Okay, Discord Kitten's currently in the lead. Alright, hold up, hold up, hold up. Discord Kitten's in the lead. It did not get a clean majority. Let's make a new poll. What tattoo? Okay, Discord Kitten. Uh, Dogecoin logo. Text... Uh, that says self made underneath. Pregnant Sonic and Mario kissing. Pregnant Mario and Sonic. I don't think that'll be allowed. 
Because I doubt the website will let us use IP that's not ours. Obama and Yoshi is an option, or Lubegate will return Pepper Riot. Obama and Yoshi. I don't want a Lubegate. Start the fucking poll. Oh, it's too long. All right, what do we got? What do we got? Think of the five Obama gate. All right, put it in, man. Matthew Ortega, thank you for the membership. Okay, it looks like there's a tight race between Obama and Yoshi and Dogecoin self-made. Here's the thing. The thing is, uh, look, I can say Obama and Yoshi win, but I think it won't work. I'm, f I'm scared of that. Because, like, I'm not a henna artist. We don't have a henna artist. I have to use a website that lets you make custom tattoos. I don't know... If you could make custom tattoos of anything. It would be weird if the website allowed you to use other people's IP and they profited off of selling you a basic art piece that you ripped off online. That's my concern. Use AI. Hire an artist. What the fuck do you think I'm talking about? The concern is not the ability to make the art. It is the IP law in where you can actually sell an ink box, like, custom tattoo or not. Like, okay, I'm going to give you an example, okay? I'm going to fucking spell this out for you. If you go on a make-your-own t-shirt website, and you make a t-shirt, even if it was for yourself, and you wanted to put, like... Sonic and Mario in it. A lot of them are going to automatically search to see if you're using any stolen IP and then take down your, your post. So, like, sometimes you can get away with it, but some sites you can't. I'm just... This is a concern. That's all I've said. I said this is a concern. Redbubble's literally not fine with it. They've taken down thousands Look, it's possible to get away with it sometimes. I'm just saying. All right, we have a neck and neck race. We have a neck and neck race. What is the tattoo? It's either... I don't know if Obama... Okay, Obama and Yoshi kissing. Or... Uh, Bitcoin logo self-made... Man, self-made. All right, here it is. Guys, if you have not yet voted, please participate in this poll. This will determine Squeaks' fate. What tattoo do we put on his body? Here's 10 for the mod since corporate Ludwig Millionaire Gobbles Super Chats. Ah. Actually, technically, if you pay me through Super Chat, it goes to my 30 employees as opposed to my 20 mods, you know? So you're feeding more mouths in a roundabout way. Obama and Yoshi kissing. That is crushing right now. Alright, I'll cut it off in a thousand more votes. If you have not yet participated in the poll, do me a favor. Vote on what you want Squeaks' tattoo to be because this will be final. Okay. Okay. All right. I guys, I think it might be final. This is a pretty huge lead. It's 56 to 44%.
with 3,000 votes. I, I think it's curtains. I think it's curtains. It's not permanent, though. It is a semi-permanent tattoo. It's not a fucking great thing you want on your body still. Obama and Yoshi. All right. Okay. All right. I do need an artist to draw Obama and Yoshi kissing. Tim, if you can help out with that. Uh, I don't know if you got someone. Actually, sorry. No, maybe I should ask Luda. <laughs> if you could get your Vaporeon artist on this. I would appreciate that. Isn't Yoshi protected IP? Yeah, I already told these dumb fucks. What do you want from me? Chat's dumb as hell. They want what they want. I, I told them about IP law. They voted it anyway. What do you... I can't do anything. If it fails, then I'm just going to say, Hey, sorry, you fucked up. You picked the wrong choice. And I, I'm going to pick chat is dumb. And I get to choose now. And you don't get to choose anymore. I'm going to take the choice away from you. And you will lose your choice. But maybe we get away with it. If we get away with it, W. You're not going to be able to tell it's Obama? Yeah, almost assuredly not. I think there's several reasons on why it is a horrible tattoo. But at the end of the day, I don't care. Because you guys picked it, and it is it is your folly, and it's not on my body. So all I can say is W choice! Actual W choice, chat. Actual w W's in chat, real shit. Uh, we'll see. Maybe it'll be fire too, you know? Who knows? I could be wrong. It ain't my body. Just got here. How's it going? Hello, Alyssa. Thank you for the $10. Thank you the membership. Aiden, Aaron. Okay, chat, I have an announcement. I have an announcement. I have an announcement I would like to make. I'm going to attempt something this month. Today is March 1st. All right? It's Women's History Month. And for women's, actually, it's really unrelated to it being Women's History Month. But for the month of March, I want to do something. Okay? I would like to attempt March Madness. Because I realized it's been a bit tough to stream. I haven't streamed so much. And so, in the month of March specifically... I would like to attempt to go live every day. That's my goal. I would like to attempt to go live every day in the month of March. Now, when I say go live every day, they might be short streams. I mean, full stop. It could be a 30 minute stream, could be an hour stream, could be an hour and a half, could be two hours. And in there, there will certainly be some bigger streams, like unpaid interns, some longer streams, like six, eight hours, watching every YouTube short I can. But I would like to stream every single day. Punishment if you don't. Hmm. That's a good question. Punishment if I don't go live every day. I won't shave my head. Guys, I've, I'm fucking sick and tired of shaving my head and losing all the viewers. What do I do if I don't? The members only streams will not count as streams. I will do members only streams this month, but they will not count. If I do a members only stream, that won't count. Get uncircumcised live, you sick fuck. You sick fuck. How about... How about a thousand gifted in a 24-hour stream if I fail? I'd have to give a thousand gifted and do a 24-hour stream.
in like 24 hours of wake stream. For, I can't do 48. I can't do 48. I, I like literally, I physically cannot do 48 hours live. Release your ball pictures on Patreon. Okay, relax. <laughs> You're off to horny jail. Come back. As a woman, I support this message. Thank you, Blake. Boo! RS Viz. Thank you for the two months. All right, that's my game plan. I'm, I'm probably, uh, and uh, honestly, there will pr uh, probably be like a lot of shorter streams, like one to three hour range. But I honestly like, I think the ideal stream in my head is like three hours. Get in, do something fun, get out, you know? Uh, but I think that's my game plan. Alyssa, thank you the 20 gifted subs. March 6th, a difficult game about climbing comes out. Oh, really? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, we're going to play that. Fuck yeah. Remind me on Discord. Give your chat your credit card. I've done it so many times. Walk a marathon in the stream room. Let me draw it. You said you loved my butt plug tattoo. Oh, you're a tattoo artist. Dude, I was like, what the hell are we doing here? <laughs> All right, Pony Larson, or Lawson, excuse me. I'll DM you on Twitter.com. I'll DM you on Twitter.com right now. You don't follow me, I can't DM you. Okay, Pony Larson. I'm out. I'm right, just kidding. I got your Twitter up. I don't... We're going to play Final Fantasy VII next week. We were supposed to play it today, but it got pushed back. So we're going to play it next week. It was supposed to be today, but the peop the good people at Square Enix were like, hey, we actually don't want it today anymore. We want it next... Uh, I think it was Thursday or something. I forget. They asked for me to delay it, and I was like, sure. I, something about their marketing. I don't know, man. Don't ask me questions. I don't know the answer to. Play Bellatro. Today, chat! Okay, today, I have to... I have a so I had a good announcement, which is that I'm going to be live every day in the month of March for March Madness. This is a true thing; it will happen. It is very cool. I also have some bad news. I have fucked up because I started something called the Parasocial Club, which has a book club in it. I, as you guys might know, have not read the book. Okay, so I need to I need to do a little bit of fixins with the Parasocial Club members. So I have to do a parasocial club stream tonight. So I'm actually going to pivot to that. Because uh, I've scammed them. And we have to figure out what our new book is going to be. What our new anime is going to be. And what our new game night is going to be. We have to figure that all out tonight. So I got to go rip that. One hour stream pain. Okay, yeah, it is a one-hour stream pain, but it's also with the promise, uh, listen to me, of streaming every single day this month. And I told you, look, there's going to be some hour streams in there. All right, but there's also going to be some longer streams. I got a Bro vs. Bro against Lily Pichu. We have our VTuber stream, which is coming this month, 100%. And we also have our uh, watching 1,000 YouTube shorts. Dude, I don't know if I want to do that one. I am going to do that stream. Oh, maybe I should do 500. Fuck, that stream's gonna suck. Maybe maybe I do 500. I think 500 takes 8 hours to 10 hours. I'm also doing something with Linus this month, yeah. I'll play Bellatro. Honestly, I might play Bellatro offline and then upload on the VOD channel. Because I've been playing offline a lot. Vibe TM, thank you for joining the Parasocial Club. Appreciate it. Don't watch them all the way through, man. I mean, I feel like I can't just, like, skip a thousand YouTube shorts, right? Like, I can't say, like, oh, in this video, I'm going to watch 1,000 YouTube shorts. And then I open up the app and I do this. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like to a degree I need to watch them. 
Let chat vote to skip. That would take longer than watching the short. Think about it, man. Setting up the poll, waiting for the poll to fulfill, like, that would take longer. I mean, I'll probably skip some if I think they're bad, maybe. Yeah, maybe I can do that. Maybe that's fair. When's Amazon order reveal? Someone tell them. <laughs> Someone break the news, because I don't got that dog in me. Uh, all right, chat. I am pivoting over. I need to do this pair of social club stream. But I will be playing games with uh, Clint Stevens and Mango, who are both live right now. So if you guys literally want to just go to Mango's stream, I'll be live on his stream in like 10 minutes. I think he's at his neighbor's house drinking scotch or whatever the fuck he does now. Uh, no, we're playing, I think, either Helldivers or, uh, what's that other game called? Rainbow Six. I'm putting the power in your hands. When I need to start streaming, I need name ideas. But listen, you're asking for the name of what your stream is? Corn section, no. I'm trying to think of a good name. Hold up. Let me let me ruminate. I'm ruminating. My brain's filling with ideas. I'm getting there. Clint? Clint Siemens. No. <laughs> Fuck, dude. I don't. Okay. Maybe I'm not the best guy for this. I might not be the best guy for this. I'm really trying here. I want you to know I've like I'm having like a Jimmy Neutron brain blast. There's just nothing going on up there. How about how about How about drunk and donuts instead of Dunkin' Donuts? <laughs> I got I got I got to get out of here. I got to, these are getting worse by the second. These are getting fucking, <laughs> you got to ask, Nick's the name guy. Nick's the name guy. It's just not my, it's not my speed. It's not my MO. F flounder, flounder. No, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm literally just thinking a verb of what I'm doing. I got it. I got it. I got it. What if you only watched every one in every five shorts and skipped four shorts at a time? I think watching 500 all the way through is better than watching a thousand and skipping personally. How about, how about, how about st Stoman? Wait, what is a Stoman? Propelled by steam to move. How about, how about Pookie? How about Pookie? We're so back! Wait, that's a thing, isn't it? Fuck. Skibbity Gat Rizzler. There you go, you're welcome. Alright, chat! March Madness, I will be live tomorrow after basketball. No. Shit.
I might go live at 9 a.m. tomorrow. You don't win. It's not Jover. It's not Jover, but I will have to get creative tomorrow, so I will... I will be live. I will be live, I promise you. I promise you on everything that is holy, I will be live. I promise you. I will do a basketball stream eventually, but l let me let me cook a little more. All right, thank you all for watching. I appreciate you. Peace. Have a good one. Stream every day this month. I won't fail. I won't fail. Hey, I'll tell you what. I've done this thing before where I've streamed every day in a month. I don't know if you've heard about it. <laughs> it turns out I'm pretty good at it. All right, see you later, guys. We love you no matter what. You shouldn't. What if tomorrow comes out I've murdered 18 children? You shouldn't love me then. Don't say shit happened. Oh my god. Okay, alright, alright. Do something nice for yourselves. Alright, have a good one. <laughs> Make future you happy. Peace.